got Cranston. We got basketball. We got music training. Hey, we got a voice generator here. Thank you very much, D-Mac. Hi there. I'm Noreen from Yulamu. Today we're going to talk about D-Mac money. What it is, where it comes from, and how you can get involved to make things better where you live. You've probably heard about DMAC. It's been helping our community for quite a few years. And if you haven't heard about it, now's your chance to find out and have your say in how DMAC money is spent. But I want to ask for that money. want to take it next next level, got enough? Next stage. DMAC projects improve housing, health, education. First, the Greenwich Mine. You know that gold mine at the Greenwich on the Tenema Highway? It's owned by Newmont Mining, and Newmont pays a special tax to the government to help the upper community. It's not mining royalty money, it's compensation money, because their mine affects an area of the upper country. That's the affected area part of the name. Today, there are nine communities that get a share of the affected area money. Larger money, Yundamu, Yulamu, Nyopi, Walara, Tanamai Down, Balgo, Villa Luna, and Ring and Soap. Larger money and Yundamu gets a bigger share of the money because they are bigger communities. Finally, EMAC is an Aboriginal corporation. That means it can be run by people from the community. Its job is to make sure the affected area money is spent properly. Anyone can have a say in GMAC. So if you want to make your community a better place to live, then you should get involved. Right. We've seen how the government collects all this affected area tax, then gives it to Yapa communities to spend on local projects. But who decides what projects are chosen? We do, through our DMAC committees. Each of the nine places has a DMAC committee. The committee is elected by the people in the community from among the local residents. The committee's job is to work with the community and find projects that will do most good for a lot of people. Is there anything else you want to add to these before we look through and pick the best ones? In each town there's a big TMEC community meeting a couple of times a year to talk about projects that could be good for the future. We also talk about how our current projects are going. Bentsport still has almost 11,000 left in their budget. And every second year, the people at those meetings vote for who they want on their DMAC committee. Prince Hambo has one, two, three. I'm on the DMAC committee here at Yulamu, and we use our money to support our sports club. We also use our affected area dollars to pay for art workshops, and we help the clinic to buy special beds medical equipment and baby scales. At Larger Money, the GMAC committee worked with the Larger Money Kidney Committee and the Western Desert Dialysis Mob. The community put over $60,000 of their affected area money towards supporting a dialysis service like in the Indomu and Kento. In Nilpi, DMAC money pays to help to upgrade the footy up. It does make um, young new footy players, make them feel proud of the footy up and grant fencing and basketball court development. GMAC you know, did help us to you know, do good. You know, help you know, what we can do. You know, and everything, you know, whatever we want to build for the community, just to develop you know, the community and how uh, to live good way. And in Mulara, GMAC community money is helping to pay for school nutrition programs, giving kids a healthy breakfast and lunch. 
The GMAC funding has provided us to equip um, and further develop the school nutrition program, which is run by the Shire. Um, from the money, we were able to purchase tables and chairs, knives and forks, and various um, eating utensils and better quality pans to, to be able to cook. Back in 2008, people here in Yunnamu built a swimming pool to keep cool. GMAC helped to pay some of the costs. But in 2010, they didn't know if they could afford to open up in summer. The local GMAC committee decided to keep in $100,000 to keep the gates open. And they kept helping us this way for several years since. No matter where you live, your GMAC committee makes sure all the projects are good projects for your whole community.